Okay, I saw uh, Tex Grebner's video and uh, uh, Cutler Lover's video about movies, the greatest movies in their childhood and things like that. I'm going to turn down the volume on um, the ice hockey so you can hear what I'm saying. It's a live game tonight. Nashville against... Uh, Nashville against uh, Nashville against someone I haven't seen so much of. Yeah, uh, yes, I saw those videos so I thought, I thought about this a couple months ago and made, made my own lists for fun uh, best action, best TV series and things like that so I thought I could show you those I have here, my camera isn't the best, so I can hope, I hope you can read what it says. Uh, yeah, the best animated series. And, at, uh, and at number seven, Star Wars, The Clone Wars. I know it's uh, childish and so, but I am really into Star Wars, so I, uh, I pretty much like that series. Number six is Futurama. Really good one. Number five, Simpson. Number four, Cleveland Show, a spin off Family Guy. Number three is South Park. Number two is American Dad. And at the top, reigning supreme family guy so the, the, that was the animated series uh, let's see here if I can show you the other stuff Oh, I forgot about this. I made um, a list of the the best slash the worst worst slash movie slash series bad guys. Uh, um, a list of bad guys. I think is very interesting. If if I can say it like that. Um, on number 10, Anton Shiguro, 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 uh, he's the bad guy in Country for Old Men, no Country for Old Men. N number nine is, nine is Max, the Losers. Number eight. Don Vito Colleone from The Godfather. Seven, Darth Vader, Star Wars. Six, Boba Fett, Star Wars. Five, Rourke, Junior, Yellow Bastard, Sin City. Number four, here's one not all of you have heard of, I think, this is uh, from a TV series, Sharps. Uh, the, the villain is uh, Obadiah Hexwell. Uh, number three, Jane Buffalo Bill Gump. The Silence of the Lambs. Number two, The Comedian. Watchmen, and number one, Dr. Handelman Lecter, The Silence of the Lambs. Okay. Let's take the next one. See if I can, uh, can uh, do every, every one of them. I'm going to make it them a little bit bigger so you all can uh, see. 
What the fuck? Yeah, the best action movies. No, I don't, I don't talk about when I was a child, I talk about all of my movie experience. So start down at number 10. Black Hawk Down. 9. The Born Identity. 8. The Bone Duck Saints. 7. The, the Terminator. 6. Zombieland. 5. Die Hard. 4. Kiss. Kick Ass. Number 3 is 300. 2. Sin City. And number 1. Braveheart. Yes. Okay, the best action series starts down at number 10, 24, number 6, number 9, Shock, number 8, Starge Stargate SG-1, 7, The Pacific, Six Band of Brothers, five The Unit, four The Ultimate Fighter, three Terminator The Sarah, Con Sarah Connor Chronicles, number two X Files, and Reigning Supreme even here, NCIS. Okay. The, be the best uh, documentary series, number 10 is Inside Vietnam, 6, uh, oh, excuse me, 9, Clash of the Gods, 8, The World at War, 7, Weaponology, 6, Deadliest Warrior, Five deadliest catch, four future weapons, three Mythbusters, two Auschwitz, the Nazi, and the final solution. And at number one, World War Two in HD. Yes, this is this is this here. The best um, drama series. Uh, how the hell was I thinking there? Number 10, Baywatch. What? Why? Okay. Uh, I don't put true blood there instead. <laughs> Number nine over there. Number eight CSI New York. Number seven CSI Las Vegas. Number six CSI Miami. Five Sons of Anarchy. Four Rome. Five three Oz. 2 NCIS and number 1 Generation Kill I do this in 2 movies I think Bye